video blog number two. Invictus by William Ernest Henley. Out, out, out of the night that covers me, black is the pit from pole to pole. I thank whatever gods may be for my unconquerable soul. In the fell clutch of circumstance, I have not winced or cried aloud. Under the bludgeonings of chance, my head is bloody but unbowed. Beyond this place of wrath and tears looms but the horror of the shade. And yet the menace of the years finds and shall not finds and shall find me unafraid. It matters not how straight the gate, how charged with punishment the scroll. I am the master of my fate. I am the captain of my soul. Okay, so this is Henley's most famous poem. It's the poem he's most well known for. Um, he wrote this during his time in the hospital, or he was in the hospital for about twenty months from the time he was. 22 to about 24 or so, and this was one of the last poems that he wrote, and it's the one that he's most known for. Um, I'll, what I got from it is it's just about him not wanting to give up, not wanting to succumb to his disease and die. It was he wanted to keep going forward and keep fighting. Um, my head is but bloody but unbowed. He wasn't going to just give up. Um, one thing that really stuck out to me was it matters not how straight the gate. Um, straight is spelled S-T-R-A-I-G-H-T, like it's in a straight line. But here it's spelled S-T-R-A-I-T. And when it's spelled like that, it's usually refers to as a body of water, um, connecting two large areas. So, I mean, in a straight, you would assume that there'd be big waves sometimes, it'd be a storm... So he didn't. It didn't matter how. It didn't matter what it was like. He could still get through it. So that's it.